because they know who you are. They know what you were meant and put in the family to do. And they, their inner, whatever they got going on is literally trying to. Y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, it's going to be a little sit down chit chat. I really want to talk to my black sheep of the family because we be the ones who be catching the most heat and we literally be out here trying to break generational curses for the family and it seems like the family is just always against us so i just want to vent and relate to my black sheep out there because i know i am not the only one out there and i know there's so many people out there that can relate to this um but yeah so we're just gonna hop right into this video if you have not already be sure to hit that subscribe button and also turn your post notification bell on so you won't miss when i upload but without further ado let's just hop right into this video dear black sheep <laughs> and i'm really talking to myself as well when i am making this video um we are the most misunderstood people of the entire family world universe whatever everything we just different we misunderstood in like pretty much everything we have literally been fighting our whole lives and we literally have never almost we never have um fit in with anything especially when it comes to our family um our family our friends they have always wanted us to go a, a certain direction that everybody in the family is going they always um expected us to go a different way do different things in life and as the black sheep of the family rules and regulations just never clicked for us realizing i never really realized it growing up um that i was the black sheep of the family but a lot of things did stand out to me um growing up just you know just never fitting in um never really getting along never really understanding how people think um i did go through a period of my life where i literally felt like i was adopted because i was not like them i was and it's not even to say it in a um you know malicious type of way or anything like that but we are literally a different breed out here and we get the most backlash as well like people are not going to understand why we're not answering the phone and that and that just goes into being a business owner as well but really just being the black sheep of the family sometimes we don't want to talk at all <laughs> sometimes we want to be left alone sometimes we need space we need air we need time to ourselves and they our families just do not understand that at all always growing up feeling like the outcast of the family was just really i just knew that i was i knew i was going to be something and it wasn't going to be the way that everybody wanted me to go which was go to school um get a degree and you know just live that type of lifestyle being a black sheep our mindsets is different like we literally think about shit that's gonna happen 10 20 years from now um sometimes it's very 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 hard being a black sheep of the family because literally you literally feel like you have nobody to talk to in your family um nine times out of ten you're the only black sheep of your generation let alone in your family period so you're gonna always feel like why am i here <laughs> i don't have nothing to relate to you guys about being a black sheep as well we tend to be the ones that go through the most shit we take the most shit and people i don't know what it is about the black sheep but the black sheep is always the one that's counted out um i remember growing up literally like being a straight a well straight a and b student meaning from step and cap straight a and b student always on my you know ish doing good and things like that and everybody was rooting for me but the moment i became a teen mom it was like none of that mattered not, like everything just went out the park and i was just literally um condemned by literally everybody in the family and around me that i was just going to grow up to not be anything and now since i have grown up and became the goat the the black goat now it's like okay everybody's looking to me for advice everybody's looking for me for an opinion and it's like wasn't y'all just the same people that was literally throwing rocks at me when I was already down and feeling helpless. And sometimes you have to go through that. Um, sometimes people in life, especially being the black, black sheep of the family, you're going to be the one who gets the, th the stones through at you. You're going to be the one who gets the most backlash and turn around and be the, the very person who feeds the family, who provides for the family, who 
breaks all the generational curses. The most important thing that I have found, especially being the black sheep of the family, you have to make sure and learn how to set boundaries and keep people from afar. Don't allow what people say or think of you to um, penetrate your heart, penetrate your mind and make you feel less than. You're different for a reason. Literally, you were put on this earth to be different, do different things and be the wealth, you know, be the cursed generation, generational breaker for families. A lot of times people put unwanted, unsolicited advice on you is because they be speak, they are really speaking from a place of hurt. Um, they've been hurt in the past or they've done the very thing that you are wishing and um, hoping to accomplish in. And literally they want to put their fears on, on you by saying, oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you or, mm, um, you know, just pre-predicting your life. And they don't even know how, how things are going to turn out just because you may have been a bad kid or even if you weren't a bad kid, you was just different. You were just not for all that, you know, stuff or whatever like that does not mean that you're going to turn out any type of way. Literally the cards can change and switch at any point given and i am a living testament of that and i really personally feel like being the black sheep of the family is literally like one of the biggest blessings biggest gifts that i could have ever been given because it's like i'm i'm different everything that i touch everything that i do everything that i put my name on is literally going to be different it's like i'm one of one which everyone is one of one but i'm really like that rare limited edition like you know how you go in the store and they got limited editions and it's only one of one like that's me that's you as well if you are a black sheep and people literally try to make you feel some type of way or put doubt or just instill this negativity inside of your mind especially at a, a young state because they know who you are they know what you were meant and put in the family to do and they their inner whatever they got going on is literally trying to stop you from what you're doing or make you feel like oh because you did this or oh because you did that like you're not going to reach your full potential and baby <laughs> the the tables will definitely turn and they will be looking at you for advice they will be looking for you looking to you for help and things like that and it's and, and even when that happens because it will don't even be no type of way or anything like that. You know who you are. You know your power. You know your calling in this life. You know what you're meant to do. And when they come to you, help them. You don't have to literally physically be there, but you know, just, you know, help them in the way that you feel that you can. And if it's too toxic, sometimes as the black sheep of the family, sometimes you just got to go your own way, make your own family, do your own thing. And that's perfectly fine as well. Um, get that out get that off my chest because i know there's a lot of black sheeps out there i know m most of my community is black sheeps and they are going a different direction they're trying to change the trajectory of their family they're trying to build generational wealth um and are the outcasts of the family and that is perfectly fine since we're gonna bring our black sheep sales over here and we're gonna build our community <laughs> And be great over here while everybody else being the same we're going to keep going our own direction and being different and being the unique gift beautiful diamonds that god implemented on this earth so just know that you are rare there is nothing wrong with you it is perfectly fine to be different it is perfectly fine to be the black sheep of the family and yeah so this is the end of this video i hope you guys liked it if so be sure to give it a huge thumbs up and if you made it our way to the end of this video and you have not subscribed what are you doing what are you doing hit that subscribe button join the family we are a community over here of girl bosses boy bosses too as well if you are a guy it's totally fine but this is the end of this video and i'll see you guys in the next one